Hey guys, Emmy here and welcome back to another episode of Mia's Story. Now, depending on what day it is, kind of depends on what I'm going to be doing. If it's a weekend, which I don't think it is, I think it's now the start of the week, I would have taken the kids out, let them explore a little bit, go to a park, that sort of stuff. If, of course, it's a weekday, then what I might do is take them out for a meal to a restaurant, as in the whole family. It all depends. So, let's get into this. Okay, guys, so it's definitely going to be a weekday. So, it looks like they'll have to go out for a family meal. Or what I can do is I can maybe try and work something out after they've got back from school and we'll just see what happens this episode and I do realize now that we left it off with a bit of an issue so eventually the neighbors kind of got the point while they might live there too my sims need to sleep so Annabelle and Marcus are the first ones to be up the reason for that is Annabelle was pretty much energized anyway so they're the first ones to be up i will get james up shortly and uh, not too far away so he needs to go to the toilet get in the shower and obviously get some food so we need to sort that out Grab a serving. Yes, I know you're sad. You're going through a phase. I think I have put Marcus to go back to sleep for a little bit. But it won't take long for him to sort that out. Annabelle, go take a seat, please, while you're eating your breakfast. James will be joining you very shortly. Annabelle, clean that up, please. Thank you. James, please hurry up with your shower so you can get something to eat. Uh, Mia, we will wake you up. I've got to have these guys on a sort of schedule. Marcus, park your bum. Let James get into the fridge. Annabelle, no, sit there. James, we're going to school in an hour. So will Annabelle. Annabelle, what are you doing? No, you go sit James hurry up and grab some food please looks like the neighbors still angry and so it should be causing ruckus last night oh uh, I'm kind of glad they only have two children and the reason for that is because if they had any more I would not be amused and I would not be able to keep up right, you're going to school why are you thinking about a motorbike that's weird James can you please hurry up and maybe not James go to school you want to catch up with your sister go on James do as you're told. James, get off of the chair. Go to school. You're going to be late. Okay, guys, so the rent is actually 1,200, which is not as bad as what I was thinking. So we're going to get Marcus to pay that as soon as he gets back. Mia has come home and she's pretty tense. She apparently wants to take a day off of work. So, obviously what I might do is, for the Wednesday, is I will get her to take the day off. It depends on what I'm going to be doing in this episode. If they manage to, if I, or if I manage to put three days in this, then I will try. But we will see. And I know I say we will see a lot. It's just because 
I don't know. Anything could happen. This is The Sims. The impossible can happen. And the game can take quite a few twists and turns. So whatever happens, happens. So guys, I've decided because Mia is so stressed, I'm going to take her to the spa by herself. Now, it's still the Monday, but apparently she's quite sore from work. So she's got like sore back, she's aching. And I just want Mia to feel better. Now, what I might do is on her day off, as in the Tuesday as well as the Wednesday, is I might get her to do stuff for herself. Whether that's going out into the fresh air or staying at home. So, this is going to be fun. I'm getting them both to work carefully because I want them to do well. And it will teach them responsibility, which will bring that up a bit more. But I will obviously need to work on some of their needs as well. And they also need to do their homework. Which... It's not going to be fun for either of them. But it needs to be done. And they're both going to be tired. That's not good. I hope they manage to finish this quite soon. How can I tell when it's completely done? Uh, they're going to need sleep soon. And Mia's not even come home yet. So, yeah, she's going to have to get a backside home soon, I hope. Because I've left her at the spa, so I'm hoping she doesn't spend too much. Uh, but then again, me. she deserves some time away from the kids. And Marcus obviously needs to help them and care for them and that Sabini sort of stuff. So, Annabelle has reached mental skill level 2, which is good. That's a good thing. Marcus, have you just disappeared to bed? Seriously? You're leaving the kids on their own? Great. Right, so James is nowhere near finished. What I might do is I might leave these here for now. And then they can work on them to the heart's content tomorrow after school uh -huh. but right now they need to get their homework done james responsibility is in rank what right, let me just pause that come on let me read that please james responsibility is in a range to earn the responsible trait that's good that's really good Right, James, are you seriously going over to Annabelle's desk? You have got your own desk. I'm pretty sure you do. Don't you? Get the, 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 come on, game. Yeah, you've got your own desk. Although, is it maybe not the kid's first desk? Hmm... Oh well, never mind. He can get his homework done and then he can do something else. Eh, you can play that for a little bit. Come on, practice. Thank you. Once your homework is done, mister, you can get that done. And get it out of the way. Mia, when are you coming home? Guys, I'm probably going to have to bring her home. Mm. 
Right, do your homework and then you can go to sleep. Okay, guys, Mia is home. She needs sleep, which she's going to do right now. James has completed his homework. That's good. And actually, James, I think I'm going to have to put you to sleep. Annabelle, what are you doing? You're doing your homework in the hair, darling. I don't blame you. I'm probably going to have to get you to do something fun in the morning and try and get your social... Dang it. Um, maybe talk to James for a little bit while you do your homework. Because you really need to get your social up quite badly. Right, do your homework. Then maybe you can talk to James. Because your social is so bad right now. I'll probably get her to be social in the morning and then... Right, so James, you can actually go to sleep. Annabelle, as soon as you've done that, you are going to sleep. Please hurry up and do your homework. I can hear the fireworks. <laughs> I really can. I don't know why I'm recording the fireworks, but yeah. It adds a little something into it anyway. Okay guys, so everyone was asleep. For some reason, Annabelle is having monsters under the bed. I really don't know how to stop that. I want it to stop. She needs sleep. But I did notice that some of the recording was sort of missing, for want of a better word. It didn't actually record. So I've done the out. I'm doing the outro again, just to be on the safe side. So I'm hoping you guys enjoyed this episode. Anyway, guys, hopefully you've enjoyed it. I will see you next time. Bye.